Hello and welcome back to another day of Vlogmas! Isn't this a nice sight? She's all curled up in the morning with her coffee, her dogs, and watching a Hallmark movie. This is like your dream come true. Wow, especially with that dog. Gee, good girl. You look very cozy. Get low. <laughs> yeah, he's <I'm> dancing. <laughs> Woohoo! Look at those dance moves. So I just got back from walking all the dogs. Lily did not do a full block. <laughs> Rosie did a full block. And Elsie did a full block. Elsie's always like, can I go more, can I go more? And the answer is usually yes, but it's pouring today and freezing. So we only got a little walk in, hey? It's better than no walks. You did good. And now I'm going to uh, my eye appointment. Sam is doing some Christmas shopping with the boys. Look, I could only find unmatching socks today. <laughs> Um, yeah, so I'm going to my lashes and yeah, Sam wanted to take the boys. I was like, you can go all alone, but she loves taking them. And then I think this afternoon we're going to go to do some more, just like not even shopping. We're not, we're not buying anything. We're just browsing. So we're going to go do some browsing this afternoon and that'll be fun. I love taking the boys out. They love stores. Like they love looking around. It's so fun. And maybe Santa. I don't know. We'll see if we can get into Santa. If not, maybe tomorrow. So. That's the plan today. It's weird to not be working. <laughs> Feels like a weekend. I am done my bulk of my work, the bulk of my work for this year, which is weird. And I never have a day where it's not work. So it's kind of odd. Like I watched a Hallmark this morning, not all of it, but that is strange. Sam was like, it's so nice that you are relaxing. She's a great relaxer. I'm a terrible relaxer. So it feels like wrong, but it's nice. So off I go. So me and the twins are out finishing our Christmas shopping and it is so busy. I <laughs> regret going to the mall now because it is like insane, but I need to get this stuff. So if there's nothing I can do. I probably should have just done it earlier. The twins love taking the elevator and I do not know why. Are you ready? Apple Store was a fail. I wanted just regular Apple headphones with a cord and they only had ones that wouldn't fit in an iPhone. Like they had ones with a regular headphone jack or like this USB-C whatever jack, not normal headphones that would fit an Apple jack. That makes no sense. I might have bought myself a few Christmas presents that I, oh, I turned the music off. You wanted to dance still. <laughs> bought myself a few Christmas gifts that I thought Allie could wrap for me that are practical that I need, like coffee syrup. Actually, I think most of the stuff I got, I felt like I couldn't find anything that I was looking for for Allie. Oh my God, I didn't know I had a second bottle. Or this would have made our trips to the mall so much easier. Espresso beans and uh, what's this called? Dish detergent washing dish dish soap dish soap. I got a whole bunch of squeezy snacks for the twins. I thought that they ate most of them on the walk. Razors for Allie's stocking. That's the last thing I needed for her stocking, but then I ended up also getting her a Ferrero Rocher because she mentioned last night that she likes them. I've never seen her eat them, so there we go. I also got ribbon we're hosting some christmas things and i want to do little like dainty bows on things i don't know i saw this because it's iconic and i love to do iconic shit like vibe and i'm really into bows right now and i just thought it'd be so cute and this is kind of like a velvety ribbon but it's sparkly it's like a sparkle velvet basically it's amazing. So I got that. If we do go shopping later, Ellie and I talked about it, I might get a second one, like a 
maybe a green or something. They didn't have anything like that at the store. So that I can do this. The thing I like about using ribbon to make bows on like our wine glasses and our candlesticks and stuff is I can reuse this for the future. I have got some really beautiful ribbons in the past and I just reuse them for everything. Mostly I use them for gifts exchange between like me and Allie, things we're putting under our tree, gifts for my family, and then I can reuse all of those ribbons for years, but also if I want to spoil and find, I'll make some more ribbons. The twins are fighting, as you can hear, over my credit card. They know the goods. Are you sleepy? The goal is one of them wants to put... One of them is trying to put my credit card in the diaper bag and the other doesn't want it in the diaper bag. Anymore. It's not easy. It is not easy having a sibling to share stuff with. Would you like to say hi? Hi. Oh, you're waving to the vlog. What are you eating? Who cuts an apple? Would know. you? Paul. What are you eating? I'm eating a nice apple you got me. Allie loves candy apples, Who like chocolate covered. Apple? <laughs> I Who love that that's that? what's bugging you. This is how you eat it. That's how you eat it. I got it for you at the grocery store, but it's like small batch made. I don't know. I just Remember found the one it. Remember we got at the market? Yes, it was very good. Remember that store that used to sell them? Rocky Mountain chocolate? Oh yeah, we used to stop and get you them sometimes as a treat. But the, no one here really store. sells them anymore, so. We should make them. Let's do it someday. Gourmet. Yeah. Ooh, I could make them right yeah. now. But would you eat them all in time? No. So yeah. let's not. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to do some shopping and not for anyone but us. Well, we're not even really we're browsing. We're going to get beans. Coffee we're going beans. to get coffee beans Homesense. at HomeSense and maybe look at maybe the bookstore. Go because we have a gift card each from the boys. Yeah, thank you boys. <laughs> yeah, You're thank welcome. you. Yeah. Um, but Allie just put the overhead lights on and we were saying why did our parents, I feel like everyone's parents, make us feel like it was so illegal to have yeah. the lights on in the car at night. Like, because I would like to read in the night. Me too. Driving, me and too. Be like, no, you can't have the lights on. But yeah, like I, this. I'm pretty sure my parents told me that like it's illegal. Like you're not allowed to do that. Why? I don't know. Is it? No, I don't think it's illegal. I don't think it is either. Didn't learn that in driver's ed, but weird. Probably would have if it was. I, yes, if it was illegal, I would have learned it. First star was HomeSense, and it was a complete fail. We didn't oh, find no, anything no, no. we wanted. The fun of it is the browsing, Laura. Yes. The fun of it you're is right. the browsing. You're right. The fun of HomeSense is the browsing, That's which we got to do. And the turn? twins rode in. This could be, yeah, if you want it to be. I didn't know. I don't know. I mean, yeah, it could be, or the next one can be. Um, HomeSense is great for browsing. It is. So we did. And the twins we, got to ride in the carts, which was very cute. I, they didn't have any of the beans I wanted. They're all sold out. I should have had more. I thought four is excessive. But then when did I you give two two away? I only gave one away. We're on our third. Oh. What's in there? Take it out. Here. You take a look. What's in here? Look, buddy. <gasps> Get that tissue paper out of there. What is it? What is it? Get that tissue paper out of there. What's in the bag now? <gasps> no way! Allie and I are having a cozy reading date night. I made dinner tonight, which does not happen often. Hardly ever. I made a stir fry, so don't think like, oh, well, Allie made dinner. I hardly ever make dinner. It's good. You are an amazing cook. I'm not I so much, but I want to learn. I wouldn't go that far. I'd be able to be anywhere. I can cook. For I think it, you're but great. That's it. I think she's good. So I made a stir fry. It's all right. I like it, but I like think it. it's good. Okay, well, I like it. I love it. And we're going to read. We're going to listen to some acoustic, not acoustic, some instrumental Christmas music. Allie is debating if she's going to put on a Yule log or a Hallmark movie on, or any Christmas, or Christmas movie um, on mute. And we're going to read. What are you reading? It's called The Other Mothers. I'm not really far into it, like barely, in, like show them. Oh yeah, that much. But it'll be cozy. We haven't really had a reading night. No, in a long time. No, we haven't. And I'm helping them get into the book. Yeah, it'll help you get more in the reading mood. The spirit. 
the spirit of reading. <laughs> and I had been reading that Once Upon a Broken Heart book, but I, I just, I'm not in the mood to read it right now. So maybe I'll just take a little break from it and get back to it. And I might start this instead. Is that the one you got today? This is the one I got today. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, why not? It is a to you. Hades and Persephone book. They're Greek gods if you don't know. Allie didn't. Okay, Allie and I just started a Hallmark movie called Secret Gifts of Santa. And in the first, like, at like 50 seconds, we were like, both looking at the screen. And, and Allie at the says, same time, I was like, oh, he's in a lot of them. And I said, can you pause on his face? And Allie was like, pause on his face. And I was like, he looks just like the premier of Yeah, Nova and then I was Scotia. like, oh, he must just look like him. That's why I thought he was in a lot. It is. It's 100% him. Uh, this, this one must, must be, filmed. be filmed in Nova Scotia. I wonder if it's the one, because that... I might have to watch it then. Mm -hmm. He probably makes a cameo. That scene, though, at the very start there... It looked like the historic property, the... Yeah, where we just were with the Rosie, twins. Rosie, how does she... Show them what she just noticed. She see Rosie! Rosie sees Rosie, that that here. is a dog right there. Fun pause. I don't know how. Um, but... Please don't bark, baby. It looks like the historic properties we were just at. And remember, we were on the waterfront once and we saw a sign that they were filming Rosie, a movie don't bark, there. And a had dog. heard it was a Hallmark. Yep. I bet it was this one. That's so random oh and hilarious. God. And we found these old photos of Rosie's like birth family, I called them. Her dog parents and puppy photos of Rosie. You could just cry all inserted here. Oh, Rosie, Sweet. you angel. You're the best thing I've ever seen. I am trying the oh. bubbly bubbly Rosie's for the like first time. Out. What's I wrong? She wants to pee. Oh, you have to go pee? Dad is the puppy. So it's the Buble Christmas bubbly. The Mary Berry Buble. I have like I can't burp. So I have like this weird like bubbling in my chest. I like it. Oh my god, the top says ho ho ho. I just spilled it on my book. I will say, most sparkling waters just taste the kind of the same to me. I don't notice a huge difference between them. You don't? No, do you? I do. Stop. Oh yeah, because we got her at Christmas. We got her on January 4th, I'll never forget the day. Quality Street changed their packaging to be these like waxy paper wrappers instead of the metallic -y ones. And I will say, they feel so cheap. Like something from the dollar store. And are they actual like... They probably are cheap because they're probably... Cutting back on costs? Yeah. They cost enough. But the price is going up of everything. Because I don't know if these are, like they feel pretty waxy. I feel like they're not compostable. But isn't that disappointing? They feel very cheap. And not like a like twenty dollar box of chocolates. Good morning, everyone. It was so freaking windy last night and so freaking rainy. And now that I look outside, Lily just went. Out. It was actually like freezing rain maybe because she didn't even make prints in what I thought was a little layer of snow. Anyway, I slept so bad because it was like pounding on the windows and it was so loud and so windy. Of course, Robert didn't do his job last night. So we've been playing a lot and we made <laughs> some Christmas cards for mommy. Now I think we're gonna go have breakfast, eh? We all match today. Good morning, vlog. I just woke up, it was my day to sleep in and I slept so soundly. I am ready to take on the day. First making my coffee. What mug do we want? So we are starting our Christmas hosting prep. This is me sitting in the stairway, replacing batteries in Christmas lights. So the playroom is super festive. Let's take a look at how this looks. I don't know if I showed you all of the changes. Maybe we'll bring more batteries. I, I ended up doing a little bit more decorating down here in the playroom. Let me show you, I just cleaned up down here. So I just cleaned the playroom. I had hung these. But I never replaced the battery, so they haven't been lit up, lit up yet. But I think they're so pretty. 
And then I don't know if I ever showed you that I hung this reindeer garland and this Merry Christmas garland. Let's close this door so we get the vibe. I got both in a little PR package and I love the little extra layer of festiveness it gives. I was watching someone's vlogmas. She's just a local girl. Her name's Brooke Wagner if you're interested. Look at how cute it's looking. So next I think I'm gonna replace these batteries. So we're going to host a couple different things for Christmas, but then also most importantly, our Christmas. So I've said before that Christmas with my family, we always do after Christmas. So it's like an extension of Christmas, which makes me really happy because Allie and I were both talking. The fact that it is almost Christmas, guys, and that actually makes me very sad because so these lights are actually trash. Negative ends. Negative end. There we go. I must have put them in wrong. Perfect. So there's a little Christmas garland. I should fluff that. I don't think I ever fluffed it when I put it in the bedroom. We could even put on a Christmas record. I have a record player down here. So like I said, we're hosting a few things for the holidays. So I wanted to get the playroom all ready for Christmas because I'm sure we will be spending a lot of time down here once the twins' gifts come. And also, I just said we spend time down here every day, so we might as well make it a little more festive. So I'm very happy with this, how this turned out. And also, the play kitchen that my parents got the twins will probably be going down here. So I think it looks good. The last thing to do is swap this out to say Merry Christmas. I am still on the odd jobs train. This time, the twins somehow did that. So I need to fix it. <laughs> Look at this cutie plate of holiday baking we have out. We're going to see Santa Claus? We're going to go try and see Santa. They're fully booked, but... Oh, you're very sure. Oh, I can't get it any higher. So, we'll go on there. <laughs> so we're going to go try and see Santa. These are our outfits. We have to decide where we're going to go. There's many places. To you the... want to go to one place, and I want to go to the other place. If we go to the... the one that you want. Well, I want to go to, it has one Woody, this guy. And it also is closer to the shelter where we have to go and drop off the gifts. Okay, fine. The twins are all dressed to see Santa. Hi, Santa! It was very successful. Neither twin cried. Yeah. We didn't like force them, obviously, to no. stay on Santa. That's they right. stayed on us. Uh, yeah, we just sat beside Santa and they were good. <laughs> oh, no, what happened? Yes, yeah, so it was very successful. Let's go. I'll insert the photos here. So last night was rough because there was a freezing rainstorm. It looks like we have a white Christmas. There is a layer of white on the ground. It is 100% ice. It's honestly shocking how slippery it is. And there is this biting cold wind and it takes your breath away. It is so cold and frigid and miserable to be outside today. Even running in to see Santa was, whew, that was a lot. Allie running into the grocery store, whew, my goodness. Well, we got some more groceries, some more, some more festive stuff for hosting this holiday season, like buffalo sauce. That's just for us, we like buffalo sauce. I am going to be so sad when eggnog is gone. Like, what am I gonna put in my coffee? This is like the shit. Like I mentioned, I am starting to get that like pre-holiday dread that I personally get, I don't know if any of you do, where I love Christmas so much. I love the whole Christmas season and I get like low after Christmas because I've been waiting for it for so long and then I enjoy the whole season, not just Christmas day. And then it's done and you pack up the, the decorations and Christmas decorations are so cozy. Christmas music is so cozy. I guess there's no rule that says I have to take it down come January, but I don't know, it's so sad. Allie, I don't know if you can see her, is just over there getting some work done. I'm about to also be getting work done, but my mouse died, so I need to charge it for a minute. 
our friends Sarah and Nolan were just over with their little baby Keely. She's 12 weeks old almost. She was growing so quick. I forgot how quick little babies grow up. It's crazy. So they were over for a nice little hangout. And I, if you remember, got this ribbon to tie cute little bows on wine glasses and glasses for parties. And I'm going to do a little tester right now. My book is so good. Look at how much I have read. I've read this like alley book. Look how much I have read. Which one? I've read this in my, my hands. Ed how look at how many we animals just have are in the book. He's coming and going. He'll be yeah, back. he keeps coming and going. Oh, Rosie's here. Uh, but we just said we don't know if these two actually know each other. I don't think they've ever met. I don't think they've ever spoken in their lives. They haven't. They've never spoken. I've never seen them actually in the same place. It's, they are the closest in age. They are. Like, I've never seen them the same year. Yeah. Or, no. We got the. Well, their birthdays are May and then February. So they're like less than a year apart. But. I've never seen them this close they've ever. They've never talked. <laughs> I've never seen them this close in either of their lives. Not like. I guess he never really occur because there's so many different pairings to interact in the day. So like Ferguson will interact with all the dogs he mm -hmm. like that. And then Shelby Smalley doesn't really talk to anyone but Lily. Talks the odd time she talks to Ferguson. Yeah. And usually and it's a fight. She does talk to Lily once in a while. She but does. I guess she doesn't talk to really like Lily. She talks to us. I've never seen her talk to Rosie either. You're right. She talks to us. She talks to us all the time. It's weird. Like, you don't notice it. But now that we... She talks to the mice in the basement. Oh, she just wanted to talk to them. Yeah. All right. Good night. Good I might night, sleep and read well, a little more. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Good night.